Leaders deliver results through team members. However, how these results are achieved is just as important. The ACTOR, or ACTOR framework, is a simple yet practical approach which allows leaders to effectively collaborate with team members to achieve the desired outcomes. There are four steps in this collaboration model. A, which stands for analyze, is the first step. Before jumping into conclusions, you want to first have the facts, figures, and reference points. Ask the team member to share his or her feelings on the topic so that you can better appreciate the context. Analyze the situation and try to assess what are the issues that may be holding back the desired performance outcomes. Is it a mindset issue or perhaps gaps in skill sets or knowledge? Review the concerns and gaps and consider the possibilities and opportunities. Think through on what are the inputs required to drive the results, including a strategy, a plan, information, activities and capabilities needed. Analyzing allows you as the leader to have a better handle on the context prior to jumping into a coaching conversation with your team member, which is the next step. C stands for coaching. The coaching conversation is usually dynamic, ranging from providing feedback to having a structured conversation using the GROW coaching framework. Consider using the SBI feedback process where S stands for situation. B is where you point out the specific behaviors and actions, and I is to highlight the impact. In performance coaching, GROW stands for goals, realities, options, and way forward. T is tracking. One of the common leadership oversights is to focus on tracking results. Actually, if you think about it, results are lagging indicators. We suggest leaders to also monitor the input, which may include the plan and the activities. Are the right activities being implemented on a timely manner with the required capabilities? These are leading indicators, and we all know the right activities done in the right way will usually produce the desired results. Therefore, a good leader will make it a habit to track activities. OR is operating rhythm. Most initiatives and responsibilities require some form of follow-up and follow-through. Having a structured operating rhythm provides the discipline that is often needed. Same goes with coaching. We encourage that coaching is not a one-off task, but rather it should be part of the operating rhythm, where the leader and the team member will have regularly scheduled coaching sessions focused on developmental and performance goals.